After you install TPT Store Link, you'll see a new tab in PowerPoint pop up. You'll get all these buttons. The first thing we're going to do is go into Preferences and we set our store URL. Mine is Bearwood Labs with a hyphen for the TPT store URL. And if I press OK, you'll see that store is set up successfully. I can now go into Insert Products and this will list all my products that I have in my store. I can search for a specific one, for example, flat pack. Can insert that. Or I can select more than one by holding my mouse button, selecting all of them and pressing OK. Before I do that, the layout I've chosen is dynamic, which means it will try and fit as many of these products into the one slide I have. If we look under the covers now of one of these products and we look at what link is put onto an image, you'll see that the product URL is automatically inserted on the image. That means if we follow this link, it will actually open the product that you have in your TPT store. You can also insert other TPT stores and their logos. If you go into Preferences and the TPT Store Attributions, you can add any other TPT store in this list, which unlocks this little button here, Insert TPT Store. I'm going to select all the TPT stores I've added. When pressing OK, the logo of the TPT store and the link will automatically be in each image. So if I go to Bearwood Labs and I click on open link, it automatically opens the link to that store. Next thing I'm going to show you is how to use placeholders to insert products into. This is really useful for terms of use pages, for example. So back in the TPT store link tab, if you click on insert image placeholder, that inserts this little square. You'll see that there's a dollar image dollar program uses to determine where to put the image. I'll also put in a description placeholder and I'm going to copy these two things a couple of times. Now, you can make any changes to this image, to this um, shape. You can rotate it, you can set borders on it or apply any effects and it will keep that. So let's try and insert products into this slide. First thing you'll notice under layout, there's four available placeholders now. So if I insert exactly four, that will fill one slide. But if I add another four, that will fill up a second slide. So there's four available placeholders, eight products will be inserted. If I press OK, you'll see that first slide has got my note to followers, etc. And on the second slide, it couldn't fit all of them in, but it's used the placeholders to put those images in. This TPT store add-in for PowerPoint is now available from the Bearwood Labs website.